My name is Jeff Don. I've been with Perfect Games since uh, August of 2010. I'm a feature writer for our website in that I do feature stories uh, primarily on prospects, but also uh, when I'm at, at various tournaments and so forth, I, I'll do uh, articles on a lot of the travel team organizations. I've also done a lot of articles on college players and high school players. Uh, like I say, I came on board uh, about a year and a half ago after spending the previous 25 years as a sports writer in the daily newspaper business. Obviously, there's a lot bigger deadline issues, and that's even changing in that realm as well because everything is going online, and that's where everything's more immediate, uh, you know, covering sporting events, and I covered a lot of high school sports here in eastern Iowa. You know, you'd literally have about a half hour after the conclusion of a game or an event to write a story, to just make deadline. And so, you know, working here, there's kind of that deadline pressure's kind of off a little bit. But I think that's, uh, it's beneficial to what I do because obviously you can put more thought into a piece and do a lot more background work and stuff if you have, you know, uh, more time to work on a story. Well, I love it. Uh, I'm a single guy. I, you know, I don't have family waiting for me at home, so I, I, I absolutely love it. And it's been, it, you know, I've been pretty much coast to coast and uh, down south, and it's just, it's been very enjoyable getting to see, you know, other parts of the country, and you know, and then of course the, the talent level of the players. You know, I, I'm not trying to knock Iowa, but just, you know, the, the climate obviously plays a huge role in that. But just, you know, you go down and, you know, to Florida and, and obviously I've been down in Arizona and Texas and so forth. And uh, it is just, it really hits home how many, uh, you know, really talented young baseball players there are in this country. Well, it's extremely laid back, I guess would be, uh, and, you know, it's just, it's relaxing, but you know at the same time, you know there's an intensity there. Uh, you can tell everybody wants to get their work done and and do it well, but at the same time, you know nobody's punching a clock. Uh, again, kind of going back, there there doesn't really. I mean, there are deadlines, of course. There's deadlines in in anything you do, but uh, there just doesn't seem to be a lot of pressure. You don't have people leaning over your shoulder. Uh, I I think. Uh, You've really got to be self-motivated, and and I think everybody that's with this company right now is, and and I think it it come that comes out in in the final product. You know, the three days that I spent out at the Perfect Game All American Classic, where I was my assignment basically was to ride on the bus with the players, with the 50 some odd players or however many there were, as they went from event to event, appearance to appearance, practice to the game itself. I was just on the bus with them the whole time and, and basically wrote a blog uh, over the course of that three or four days. And that was just very enjoyable, getting to know the kids, getting to know the guys that were the coaches, uh, just, just getting to know that whole group. Uh, I, I just, I really enjoyed that and thought it came out or came up with some pretty good storylines The the visit to the Rady Children Hospital you know was it was unbelievable uh, watching those young guys interact with those uh, young cancer patients and so forth it was just a, a very rewarding experience I guess 